What's up? Welcome back to the channel. So I saw a lot of uh, electric go-karts getting around and I've wanted to build one myself for a while. I managed to find a nice roller on Marketplace that was uh, pretty reasonably priced. And uh, with a few spare parts I had lying around and with the Marketplace, I managed to get all the uh, Suron parts. I built this cart with just Suron bits. It's the Suron battery, controller, motor. I got the harness. Um, electronics off uh, Aliexpress and um, yeah I don't expect any huge power from it in stock form but I can upgrade to the 72 volt which I will do once it's all built and going um, I'll show you where I'm at now and yeah we'll get building and do a little bit more on it today all right here it is I've made up a um, mount for the motor so I did have this motor Flip the other way with the sprocket on this side. Uh, that made the motor spin backwards. I switched to phase wires. I tried all the combinations. I did get it to work in reverse, but after about five, 10 seconds at full throttle, it, um, it, it cut out and I had to off the throttle then back on. So I had no option but to flip it over the other way. Here's the controller, I'm gonna mount this up top. I was gonna mount it down there, but there's not enough room for the phase wires. I can extend them, but again, I just wanna build this just pure Suron. Um, I think it'll be better up there anyway, because it gives me room to run my cables for the battery. I've just put a new seat on there. The last seat had a hole in it. I'm gonna remove the fuel tank, don't need that anymore. I've got it all connected up. Um, here's the kit, I've got the air switch, same stock Suron air switch, Flip that on. Key on, there's the display, starts up. I do still have the uh, actual Suron throttle, but I do have a, uh, a the foot throttle set up. That's in eco mode, get up into sport. Here, the regen still on. Um, yeah, there you go. Super stoked that we got it going. I am going to remove this guard here and make a different guard. It's uh, just sitting on the sprocket a little bit there. All right, let's uh, make up this bracket and get the controller mounted and figure out how we're going to do the battery. I've got the controller mounted up now. Got the brackets made. That's pretty happy with that. That can sit there like that. See, I've just bolted on here. It's solid as. Um, just trying to work out where I'm going to run these cables because I'm thinking I'll put the battery on this side. So I'm going to need to have, have these cables up somewhere behind here. And I'm still going to need to get a chain cover. Pretty happy with the progress that I've made. Um, yeah, stay tuned and I'll put out part two and hopefully we'll get that battery mounted on the next one. Cheers for watching.